Only Victor Tubes and Just Komomo YouTube channel. The Yellow Spovidarius, we have a big 30 a donkey, proton and a big music countif. Si who si hot svito, yak for domak, dak imalam domak artistif. Ya obisayavam, shinovin ne publica, shovin ne bulente, thus shinovin exosium. Pre hit the tis de mahokanalu, de be pleased with this, de vikrova de lazam zem nodu, dem no vishnik artistif. Now, my next reaction, I'm very, very excited. I believe the first time when I reacted to Goa is when they was particip participating in the Eurovision Song Contest. So that's how long ago that was. And that's when it started me on my journey to what is Goa. And it's been sensational. So thank you very much for all the Goa fans supporting my channel in supporting Goa. And it, it, I think, I believe it, at that time when I first reacted to Goa, back, I'm talking about a number of years ago, um, that was uh, my second or third highest ever view on my channel at that time. I was like, what? And I was excited about that in itself. So this next song, what they have is um, in English, Mermaids. Um, in Ukraine, um, is it Rasheloshki? I hope I'm pronouncing that name right and not getting it um, wrong. She has put some things, they have put some things, um, some contents in the description page. So it says, Electro Folk Hitmaters Goa are presenting their brand new single, Rasolotsky, um, after release of their, uh, of the last year's single, uh, oh yeah, 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 uh, Kalya, um, and the recent guest appearance at the Eurovision Song Contest in Liverpool. There you go. Um, fans were really looking forward to hear the Ukrainian band in their new repertoire. Whoa. A uh, beauty uh, story explained the um, origins of the song, which is is what makes this release even more special. Okay, Rasculus, Ras, I've got to pronounce this name. I've got to go back. <laughs> um, Rasculosity, but is that what it says here? No, it doesn't. So this says um, Rasica. Rasica is a culture from Ukrainian Ukrainian mythology. Years ago, go led. Le Lead um, singer, lead singer, um, Kate, um, Kate took part of a folklore expedition, okay, where she met a group of grannies who were resettled from their home, oh, okay, um, in Chaboni. Um, Elena has done a song and where she's videoed in there. I've uploaded it about, say, a couple of days ago. So thank you very much for that amazing amount of information because I thought it was really a dangerous area how, how toxic and radioactive it is. And it's just, you know, it's, there's certain guidelines, don't touch the metal, blah, blah, blah. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for informing me about that. Um, air is due to disaster on the power plant. Yeah. Those grannies showed Kate a magical ritual accompanied, um, was it, I'm going to pronounce my names, Russ, Russell Cuss, Russell Cuss to the forest. That experience was very inspiring to Kate. And one day she wrote a, ah, okay, um, Russelowski. Right, the song is about finding yourself in a world where a person lost their home forever, a story about trying to leave your past behind and attempt to live a new reality. Get that, okay. So this song was released with a music video and was shot in Kyiv during the missile attack. The sounds of alert and explosions were coming from every direction while the band was working on the set. Old women on the videos were keeping of Ukraine and folklore from the assembled, um, oh, I'm going to, I'm going to be terrible with these names. Um, is it Berihanya? Is that, is that how I pronounce it? Which were under Rus um, Russian occupation on the northern part of the Ukraine in 2022. Despite a huge danger and a long way, these grannies were happy to come and take part in the video shooting. Well done. These women who were witnesses of the two horrible wars are a symbol of resilience of Ukrainian people who stay out of the land, keeping their tradition despite any circumstances. Okay, look, we'll just go straight into uh, my next reaction of today. I hope that's put you in, uh, you know, in a position. Apologies, it's taken so long, indeed longer than the actual um, music video itself. So by all means, slap me in my face. But without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video audio music. Can you dig it? Are you ready? I am. Wait for it. Ooh. 
таке. Рано, рано засвітила, сонечко, рано, рано прилетіла, пташечка, рано, the harmony to this man. Like a death note underneath it. Okay. I never knew about the lady in red or the woman with the red cloak until a number of stories from Ukraine. It's amazing about the history of Ukraine and how much is being sporadic over various countries which we think is from that country and not actually from Ukraine. Mind blowing. And there's the old ladies, the grannies, that still live in the area. The note resonated. I like the contemporary art form, it means so much. Be fair, this song can only be played at one level, and that is to the max. Oh, look at this cup. This is absolutely an art form. You can't deny it. So that was Goa with Rosolotsky, which translates to English is uh, Mermaid. So look, I'm glad that I read out the description, even though it took ages for me to read out and understand it, I'm glad that I do because it puts your mind into a better perspective when you press the play button. And I've always said this to everybody, don't just go and press the play button where, you know, you just go straight to the music. Find out about the artist creation behind it, what it took, what it took, the history behind it is really, really important because if it wasn't important, they wouldn't have put it there. It's a simple thing, isn't it? So the least you can do is read it and enjoy reading it. It's, it's history, man. It's lessons we learn. So it's not only about music and listen to great music, fantastic music, but there's substance behind it. And if you take the time before you press that play button, you might find a little bit more about the artist inclined, a little bit more about the background. That's a little bit more to get you more closer and more personal on a kind of personal term, so to speak, personal artist celebrity terms. Um, because they, they're, giving, they're taking the time out to show you, look, this is a little bit about ourselves. I think it's fantastic. I really do. And for that reason, I salute you. Boom.